you need another hard conversation with Carl. I just don't know what to do. Like, is this kind of killing me? And I just feel like things are snowballing. Yeah. And it's nothing feels right. Well, this feels right now. I didn't want to talk to you, but now I'm kind of glad that we did. Give me a hug. I'm, yeah. I'm honestly, like, I'm sorry. I know it's like we're kind of caught in the middle sometimes. Yeah. You can't always be going to bat, you know? Sometimes you just want to have some fun. Now that's everything. Oops. Oh, man. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye, Danielle. Drive safe. Au revoir. Don't give up. I was just going through the photos of that um, cobalt blue set, the yeah. pleated stretchy one that we love. Like the material just really photographs nicely. It really, the color looks beautiful. So I'll edit some of those photos before Sunday. All right, let me just get you here. Kind of like, yeah, you're, so you're just, you're gonna be just stepping down this way. You're kind of like looking over this way. Yep. Nice. Did you put that up there? We gotta take that down. You know it freaks Ryder out. We gotta put it away. It's okay. I know. Okay. Girls, come here. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Come here. It's just a picture of mommy. Hey. All right. Sit. Good girl. Um, what do you think? I mean, I think it looks amazing. There's some things I'm worried about, like this not being legible and this color like not popping anymore. But it's actually crazy how different it looks in the sunlight than it did when I was uh, on the other side of the apartment. We gotta get to the office more. <laughs> I know, right? We finally got a Loverboy office and it's right across the hall. Far enough away where I don't have to talk to Kyle or hear his voice all day long. But close enough that I could walk over without my pants on. Super convenient. But like, look how cool our cans are. I think it looks like Something. the best variety pack that's ever hit the market. Um, did Carl send his email? Yeah, so he's gonna come over and we're gonna talk it through. Hey guys. Hi. Yes. <laughs> you okay, it's Carl. We're actually just going over the variety pack swatches for the printed cans. Oh, cool. Well, not to give you the boot, but um, no, it's fine. we got work to do. That's fine. I'll see you. Yep, bye then. Come on, babies. Well, look, man, like I... I yeah, I know there's a, there's a lot to talk about, obviously. Um, yeah. So, just to kick it off, like, first and foremost is our friendship. And I, I, I feel bad about last weekend. You know, this has been a slow build. I think it just was coming out in the form of like a venting session because I don't vent to Amanda. I understand like you're allowed to voice your frustrations and vent, but it was hard to kind of hear from Danielle about what was said. I mean, I've struggled at times to kind of assess and understand like what really makes sense for me. I've been basically wearing the VP of sales hat and then I've got to go be the guy that's the face of the brand. And I've got to go be the guy doing public, you know, appearances and meeting people doing events, doing samplings. It's like almost I've been wearing like all these different hats. It just, it's, it's just a ton. And I feel like sometimes I'm like walking away with it. I'm like, wait, I don't, I'm not even getting compensated separately for some of these things. But like, when I read your email and you're talking about how much time you're putting in, you know, when you talk about 90 hours, I was struggling these last couple months to figure out if you're working 40. Really? J just, just cause like, I'm not hearing from you and, and a lot of people aren't hearing from you. Well, and, I, and I would completely agree. I mean, I, I feel inadequate. I feel like I've missed things and I've, for whatever reason, haven't had the eye on the ball sometimes because I do get distracted with the other things of the business that just come inherently. I think I want to help you do is reevaluate how you're spending your time. Yeah. Like, I want to make sure you, you're, you're using your time wisely. When I, yeah, and I, I just, I hate, I hate not having like a firm answer for you of exactly what I want to do. We'll probably just rethink your title candidly, you know, and make sure you feel appreciated and you're doing what you like doing. I think that's a great idea. Friend to friend, let's just never let this happen again where whether it's tension between our girls or our business, I don't ever want to feel like I, I was feeling.
Were we dancing around a couple hot topics? Absolutely. If we said what we probably truly felt, it would have been abrasive to say the least. I'm kind of recognizing like friendship first and I'm gonna do my darndest to help support him as a CEO. I gotta go make sure man is working. <laughs> Yell at some distributors. Let's do it. I just want to make a blanket statement that if you guys have complaints about my driving, same here. Don't kill me. Yeah, like as long as we arrive alive. Okay, noted. There he is. Personal escort here. Hello. Yeah, I got the dog here back here. Great. If I start sneezing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry about that dog. If I start sneezing. Away we go. Do it. So how's your week? My week was good. I got a facial for the first time ever. Wow. What sparked the facial? You just My... feel dirty from the summer house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was just so much dirt on me. What did you guys do this week? I work. Sam and I went on a double date last night. <laughs> a double date? What okay. happened to, uh, to Josh? I still think he is cute. I just he like, I wasn't feeling like romantically obsessed with him. 